Welcome to Tesla Bytes, where we serve you GIS in small bytes. Today we'll be covering how to convert a shapefile to KML in ArcGIS Pro. To get started, I've already loaded a shapefile and made a layer. You'll see that it's surrounded by the Harris County outline, but we'll only be focusing on the zip codes here in a transparent blue. Satellite background is to assist so that we know what it might look like in Google Earth. Now let's head over to the properties of the layer. We're going to edit our display expression. It tends to default to object ID or other attributes that may not be as useful. I have mine set at zip code. In the pop-up for Google Earth, there's a little blue bar, and if you want it to display other information in the object ID, then you'll want to set that here. Click OK, and then navigate over to the data ribbon. From the data ribbon, we're going to look at the fields we'd like to see in our pop-up. I've selected only the ones I want visible as feature ID, zip code, and shape area. Click Save, and then from there, easily go to the Analysis ribbon, where we'll select Tools so that we can run our Layer to KML tool. Type in KML, select the tool, and then choose your layer from the dropdown. I'm going to select zip code. Also an output file location. Since we'd like our features to be clickable and not a single composite image, we don't need to check this box. And we also don't need to worry about the image properties where there's resolution and DPI. We are going to set our extent properties. We'll select zip code. The reason we've chosen this extent for zip code is so that when we start up Google Earth, we don't get the entire globe, but instead we zoom to this area from our KMZ. Select Run. And when it's complete, you'll see a summary here. Here we are in Google Earth. No, you're not seeing double. I've got Google Earth here on the left, and I've got Google Earth Browser on the right. You can see that the pop-up in both of these is functioning as we'd expect. We can also zoom in and still see our polygon outline. Click on the pop-up and we have a new zip code. I think this is a great stopping point. This has been Tesla Bytes, where we serve you GIS in small bytes. Thank you for watching, and please be sure to visit us at www.tessellations.us. Also, subscribe and ring that bell.